Tutorials by Andrew Buckle. In this tutorial, I'm just going to show you how you can use a border shape to uh, create another border shape, or more interesting border shapes than just to say a single shape. Now I've got a shape here, got a custom shape tool, pixels, and these shapes here are graphic extras, custom shapes, frame shapes. Of course, you can find many others on the web or create your own. And you can just quickly create frame design and then obviously just add the image in the center. But you can also obviously use that to create frames or borders. Now, view, because what I want is actually the guides. And I'm just going to go to new guide layout. I'm going to go for uh, like 9 by 9 Of course, I could go for 10, 20 by 20, 21 by 21, or even 21 by 9 or whatever. So I'm just going to select that. And now what I can do is go to view and snap and snap to guides. That's a key thing. All right, make sure it's on still. There's always a tendency to suddenly turn itself off. Right, so, and then you can just basically alternate custom shapes, just add them like that. Or maybe, and I'm just gonna go around a bit further so you can see the general gist of the frame. So you can just go all the way around, or maybe change the color, and just fill that, say blue, or use a different shape. That's another option. Of course, you could then go maybe fill that one there with black and so on and so on. There's like literally thousands of possibilities. And of course, you don't have to use that. You could use a circle, other designs, stars, full of middles. Anyway, it's endless. Thought. But then once you've done all the way around, you can then fill the central part with the image. And also, of course, you could select the inner parts of those and copy parts of the image and there's so many variations you could do with that. So again, so you can now make, obviously make it maybe bigger designs. Again, it's got still got the snap to. You can snap to all the way around. Maybe snap to, have it alternate slightly out, and so on and so on. Just like that, and create a frame all the way around of similar sort of thing. And again, fill the central part with an image or whatever. Hope you found this of interest. 